Oh. Hey, H family, and welcome back. Uh, today we are going to be having the ATB Tyson uh, spicy yeah, buffalo. buffalo buffalo chicken strips, and then also um, Cajun, or is it spicy? Let me see if I can find the bag. I would like them to know what kind of fries these are. He's going to get the bag real quick. Also, guys, oh my God. I know I mentioned the last time that we, they have not came out with another new um, limited edition green tea since that last one we tried. Guys, they came out with an, what, how do you say this? An Asian pear. Yeah. Okay. I didn't want to say it wrong. <laughs> Asian pear um, flavored green tea limited edition so we will let y'all know how that tastes so the ones we use are they're the heb brand heb french fries spicy seasoned um they are awesome like guys they they okay so in the same brand they make the little potatoes that, that we use in our seafood yeah when i don't cook their because we we find it easier to use the ones that you microwave versus the ones that you throw in the seafood boil, like boiling with the crawfish and everything. Serve yourself. We have more um, fries coming out of the oven. Y'all know I had to bring my camo. <laughs> camo? Or my camo. Duh! My camo, <laughs> my, my cowhide little uh, oven mitts. I'm going to put them right here in the middle of us in case you want more fries. Let me get them out of the air fryer real quick, guys. Oh. Maybe. Mmm. Honestly, I'd probably eat these first than the ones that we have on our plate since they're nice and fresh. Yeah. Out of the air fry. Can you pass me the ranch? Oh, I have to go get some ranch. It's the only way I use, eat the carrots and celery, guys. I'm so glad y'all enjoyed yesterday's seafood boil video, guys. I am so glad. Get this? Oh, I'm gonna try the tea. Have you tried it already? Yeah, just try it, it tastes like apple juice. Oh man, I wouldn't do it again. She probably would. It kind of does taste like apple juice, but still, a hint of, of pear. It's good, but probably wouldn't do it again. But if y'all would like to try it, it's limited edition and your local H E B. <laughs> they may or may not have it. Yeah. Not all HBs carry it. Ours only had one case. All right. Let's go in for this chicken strips. First time we tried this flavor. We usually do the honey barbecue. Mm -hmm. Maybe if we had some wing sauce. Yeah, it's not really that spicy. Whew. Hot. What? Fries. And guys, the seasoning for the fries, you're thinking like, oh, it's just spicy seasoning. Like, they have a good kick. A good kick. Like, it, it man, I don't think, what was the last thing we had with them? Um, wings. Wings. Sorry, we didn't do a video for that. He has a pink one in his hand, guys. Oh, damn. 
It's not two times, but it, it... You have to shake the bottle first, baby. Oh. Why? Because it, it they separates. separates. And then you get nothing but oil. Mm-hmm. I didn't even sound like I said Show me the hiccup? No. Right. Almost choked. Careful. Cause this one has like a cheesy um flavor. The pink one's not that, it's not hot at all. I'm about to start getting hiccups, guys. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm already sweating. But it's good. I like it with the, the chicken, chicken strips. One of y'all came and left a comment on the on the seafood that he laughed or she laughed the fact that I started with the corn. The reason why I started off with the corn, guys, is because I was using Kerrygold butter, and before I dipped in the shrimp and all that crab seafood in it, I wanted to get the actual taste of just the Kerrygold butter. Just the butter, yeah. Because after a while, it starts tasting really seafoody. Like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something simple today. I went shopping last night <laughs> for something fast for snacks. <laughs> when she was like, "Good dinner." Well, he was his stomach was growling. I was what was it like nine, ten? His stomach was growling after we ate the seafood. But we had ate the seafood earlier. It was like five when we ate it. Didn't go to work again. All right, you got paid for it. Heck yeah. <laughs> What's up, Yeah, his foreman had to go to Home Depot today, Home Depot today to get some material. Because Walmart lost their materials. No, they haven't even received it. Oh, they haven't even received that. My bad. <laughs> Lila over here being a cutie. I know, it's not their fault. So they're still getting paid for it. I would hate for you to be off and it not be your fault. Oh man, I would, I would. And especially I being out here, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I don't have to pay for the room, but still, like, I'm not getting paid. But he is. But I am. Don't give her none. It's 
I want her to meet her. Yeah, what do you mean? Check. <laughs> she smells your hand like, you got some? <laughs> Lola and uh, Momo are in the kennel because one of them is sick. We don't know who. So, if y'all hear movement, it's them. We have them separated right now. Lola's been really grouchy towards her. Mm -hmm. Towards Momo. And then Layla's over here trying to beg daddy for more. They're nice and crispy. But they're hard. Yeah. The chicken? It's not hard. Just split them? Mm. Well, what you talking about, Willis? No, Leila. No, ma'am. Um, I made more jewelry, more, um, I'm getting a little better. I'm watching videos, tutorials on how to do stuff, and it's looking good. I'm so proud of her. Yeah, Tommy's like, oh, let me go buy you more stuff, let's go. <laughs> but, oh, it's but I'm telling him, like. Let me use what I have now. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Not only that, at the same time, I love seeing her, like, you know, get down and do her stuff, but... Because I am very crafty. You know, I wish, I wish that I could do something. Like, other than go to work. I wish I could, I wish I had an imagination for that type of stuff. Or, like, I don't know, crafty hand? I don't, I don't know how to say it. Because <clears throat> I was doing the wood burning, but... You did really good. Sometimes, like, it just, it, it's boring. <laughs> and you can't do wind burning here. The windows don't open. Yeah. It lets off a lot of fumes. Probably the alarms, the smoke alarms will go off. <laughs> Guys, and I'm trying to do as much as. This was just because we wanted something simple and fast. Because um, it's kind of hard to do dishes here in the hotel. But it was hard to do the pots and pans yesterday that I used for the seafood. <laughs> it was hard to do it in that in that restroom. Um, do I take a shower? <laughs> um, it was hard to do it in the sink, in the little sink. Um, not only that, they said that we can cook. Just don't allow it. Like, to keep your eye on it and don't allow it to make a lot of smoke. So the alarms will go off and it'd be a disaster. The people next to us, I uh, think the first day that we used our princess house, um, we were making something. They were like, dang, it just smells good. Oh, well, I made um, Oh, the salmon with the, um, the green beans grilled in... Um, with onions and garlic. garlic and butter. Yeah. Yeah, the neighbors came out. They were like, "Oh, it smells good." We were mm -hmm. like, "Yeah, we got a hot plate." Mm -hmm. Next day, all the power goes out. They go because they went and bought a hot plate. But I used the what is it called? That thing. The. The power strip. The power strip. So instead of blowing the whole, you know, 
it, it just blows the power strip. It turns off. But the thing that I think they did was they used the microwave while using the their hot plate. You can't do that. It will. It's too much electricity. It will short it. And I even called the front office, and I was just like, "Is everything well, okay?" Yeah. <laughs> they were like, "I don't even know what that was." <laughs> but it turns out that the neighbors bought a hot plate and tried cooking. But your girl knows how to do it because you know we lived in a one uh, the one um, bedroom house with the that our electricity kept going out and kept going out. But because the breaker box wasn't up to date, record it was not up to date, and it had the old um, what do they call it? It has a like they look like light bulb like the okay so the part that you. How you put them in the house or into the the electrical box? They're little. They, it, the back of it looks like a like a light bulb. Like you screw it in like a light bulb, uh, but they're fuses. Mm -hmm. They almost look identical to the fuses on your car, but it screws in. And then once they blow, unscrew it, put another one. Yeah, but. Um, I was talking to my stepdad, and he said that those are, like, they shouldn't even be. Okay. okay, so the company that makes the fuses, they make the fuses for several different things. The The house um, that we were in, he said that that should have been eliminated a long time ago. Um, so basically, they use them now just for, like, little storage, like, little, like, sheds, right? Yeah. To run your sheds and stuff. Like mm. electricity into your shed. But, yeah. I don't even know what to talk about no more. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. We haven't really done much. <laughs> Y'all. I am tired of sleeping. Tommy sleeps a lot. Like we're we're getting used to our schedule. Like the the yeah, because Thomas was off and we could have gone to sleep at a at a normal time last night. And we gotten up early. Yeah, and but we're so used to his work schedule already, like him working literally until five. I, I woke up around nine thirty because I, that's you know normally the time that I was supposed to go to work. Um, woke up around 9.30, get a text from the boss. He's like, yeah, same again today. No no work, you know, until tomorrow. I was like, always okay. Because always before work, guys. Uh, always. Because, it, you know, it helps me, like, all right, let's go. Because um, I'm, you know, I'm. He takes a nap for everything. I guarantee you after this, he probably going to want to take a nap. And he just woke up. No, I probably want to go visit Kai. Because we haven't done it. In a little while. Um, but, uh, we're, yeah, uh, 9.30. Literally, got, as soon as I got the message, I could have been like, all right, baby, let's go to sleep. Get up in the morning, go donate. Tell me why we were up until 5 a.m., 6 a.m. Like, literally, I had, a, I had enough time to beat everybody to the, the breakfast downstairs Mm -hmm. Managed to get four waffles without uh, the freaking people being like, come on, like, hurry up. No, we didn't eat our four waffles. No. We always say two. <laughs> yeah, always. Because we do the, I, I add chocolate chips to mine, so it's like a like a sweet bread. Yeah, he actually got into it. <laughs> right, right before. before this video. I'm just looking at him like, boy, we about to eat. <laughs> I gotta do my hair again. Yeah, we haven't done it because he had. I scraped myself at mm -hmm. work. I was on the lift, and uh, whenever I was going into the store, I I I, I thought I dug down far enough. Well, I didn't, and it scraped me. It had a big old boo boo. Oh man, I, I didn't even feel it. Like yes, it hurt. Yes, it was like it was sting. It would sting, like different times through that night. 
But that was it. I get home a couple days later. She goes, oh, shit. It's, it's uh, scabbing up. I was like, what? Like, that means at one point, I would have to have been bleeding. Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't know. Um... I could do it. What? The. Yeah, we're not good. The pear. I could do the pear again. Just one. I think I'm done eating. Yeah, me too. We <laughs> practically got the same amount. Just one less. Well, the fries, I, I wouldn't mind the fries, but I'm done with the chicken. Y'all, you'd be surprised how much we argue over food. Like, and it's me. Like, I'll, I'll be like, I want my own. <laughs> but which he had it um, <laughs> just. I think, oh, uh, guys, our first argument ever, it was over pop tarts. It's over pop tarts. Like, okay, so. <laughs> I oh, open man. a pack. I open a package, and I'm eating. You're gonna be like, "Oh, this fat ass, go, go, <laughs> go!" Just tell it. It's fine. Um, I open a package or one little, you know, sleeve of the pop tarts. I'm eating one. She goes, "Ooh, I want one," and thinking of. Her wanting one, I literally hand her the other one in the sleeve. <sighs> Guys, this girl gets so mad at me. She's like, I want my own. And I'm like, Can you put that over there on the side? I'm like, But it's the oh, same. Right I'm done eating. And she's like, No, it's not because I don't have my own. I'm like, are you are you listening to yourself right now? What I was what I was trying to do was okay. I'm eating one. That I have one left in my package. I give her the other pop tart. Right. Open another package. I get one pop tart. She gets one pop tart. No. You, see, girl, you didn't I, say that. You didn't say that. You only wanted to give me one. That motherfucker just gave me a whole freaking one. <laughs> no. <laughs> we got uh, then. Then we like we talked it over. <laughs> um. And then. <sighs> and then what happened? We went to go pick up our brother. <laughs> Yeah, it was when Thomas and I were first dating. Because we were still dating. We were not together yet. Girl, we were dating. We were together. No, we. it was not an official, like, boyfriend-girlfriend. It was... Yes, because I kiss you. <laughs> Just because you kiss me don't mean... <laughs> it wasn't to where we were together together. We got together on October... What? 27? 17. Oh yeah, he was still in school. Yeah. What? We didn't get we didn't get together until I left to Mexico. Literally, I got got with you and then I left to Mexico for two weeks. Remember? And we were dating maybe like a month before that. Oh yeah. Because you were still at the Haven for Hope, and then yeah. You were still at Haven for Hope. You didn't move into my vehicle until I got back. He was a security guard then at the rim. Mm-hmm. But I was still chunky. No, baby. You were skinny, baby. Uh, yes. That first, the, what was it, Thanksgiving or Christmas? The first Christmas that you were with us? And we have a picture of you. <clears throat> and, and you can see my Adam's apple in that picture. He was skinny, guys. Oh, do I tie that? 
I named him Chucky, apparently. What his mom says is that force feed him. <laughs> Did she tell you that? No, it was just the... <laughs> I think you were skinny because you were homeless, living at Haven for Hope, and not and having good uh -huh. And then I when I was when I wasn't at work, like before she left, when I wasn't at work, I was with her. Like I was supposed to be sleeping because I worked nights. Uh huh. No, I was with her. He always wanted to spend time with me. I'd be like, "What are you doing? Come pick me up." And he would. He was working, and he had he was doing checks, guys. Just no, no. I had I had. Okay, so whenever we uh, got together, I had barely started you that job. Yeah. Before you were at the when when you came back mm -hmm. is when um, we actually st I moved into your van. No, and... my van. I didn't have a van. Oh, I had a jeep. Your jeep. Yeah, I said van. Um, sorry if y'all can't see me. I keep turning like white as a ghost. I had a Jeep, guys. A, an old Jeep. A 98 Jeep Grand Cherokee Laredo. I loved it. But, uh... All metal. There was no plastic in it. She was all metal. You mean the frame? Yeah. Oh, yeah. No no fiberglass or whatever. Oh, all yeah. She was all have. metal. She was... Which all, all older vehicles are. Thomas crashed it when the for that first time he crashed it. It didn't get so bad. The 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 damage wasn't so bad to our vehicle compared to those people's vehicle. Their their car was damaged. Ours, um, all I did was zip tie the lights back on and yeah. It was still drivable, and that other car was not drivable no, at all. No, because they the way they hit us, their our fender. And, they hit us. and the corner of our bumper went straight into their uh, their radiator. And they but, tried blaming us, but we other people that are like, no, it was their their fault. Because we were in the turning lane, like to go, like to turn around, like to turn into a business. We were in the turning lane already, and he came out of Bill Miller's and just like boom. Mother. Yeah. Freaker. But uh, anyway. Um, I used to feed Thomas, guys. I always make sure that he had a meal. And he'd be like, why don't you, why aren't you eating with me? And I'm just like, well, no, I'm because to Because sure y'all know, like, as a man, like, it, it just, it didn't feel right. Look at that. It's so <laughs> cute. Um, oh, big old yawn. Yeah, because I would go donate. And because I was actually going to school. Still. No. Oh no, I was not going to school no more. You were in between homes. You were helping with Jocelyn. Jocelyn. In her home, her yeah. house. I was living with my sister. Because before I met Thomas, I was with my ex. That it was not a good relationship. I was with them for a couple years too, but it was hard to get out of that relationship. It was abusive. <sighs> And once I actually did, took the advantage, and my sister went and picked me up, and I just gathered some of my stuff and left. But anytime I wasn't at work, like whenever she would pick me up, and Thomas asks me, like, "Do you regret like leaving the relationship?" Because I, I did, like. The relationship, I, he would give me money. He would give me everything. Like, I had a nice, you know, one of the new homes. Um, it had a, what was it? A four-bedroom um, house. Two and story. it was two stories. Um, out in the Kirby area in San Antonio. Um, nice cars. Everything. Nice neighborhood, but I told him like no, I would never go. Like I don't regret it at all. I don't regret leaving it. Like and not only that, I wouldn't see my family at all. <clears throat> I just need all the love and my honey here. She shows me all the love. You may not have the money and all the money in the world and stuff, but 
I'm happy with what I have. Even when we don't have it. <laughs> Come back. And guys, whenever we have money, we always, always make it a, a point. Regardless of what situation we're in, we always make it a point to make sure that we treat ourselves because we we're not the kind of people that or we don't have access to money all the time okay. so so when we do have we're we... try we're trying to we try to like all right you get this much i get this much let's go crazy like this past check uh i paid off some money to my sister and to my dad because we did owe them um because my dad has helped a lot like a lot guys like extremely a lot i still owe him like 270 <laughs> which he'll get this week um but we did he got 50 and i got 50. well actually i ended up getting 60 but they, i went over a little bit but he wanted me to get it so i bought the material to buy um to make my jewelry which with what i already have i already made like I already made enough. Triple. Like triple. Like she spent sixty. She's like with everything together, I guarantee you she's around like three, four hundred like to sell everything. Which I will be getting back to that because I do resell guys. Um once I get back to San Antonio, if we ever go back Depending if they do need him to move on to the next location once it, this location is over with. If it's not, fuck it. I'll well, just do some Uber Eats. For a little while. Yeah. Um, but the, his case, the, the lady that got him the job um, did say that she would look for something else if they don't need them at the next location. Um, just sometimes it takes a while. What does she call like a recruiter? Mm -hmm. Job recruiter. Um, she said that she would find him something else. Which Just sometimes <clears throat> it takes a while, a little bit. The guy over Melissa, um, the the guy that's over my recruiter, said that or uh, told Move one of the over. other to, what? Move your head over. She's looking, Layla, she's Hi. looking out the window. <laughs> Oh man. Come here, Layla. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Go ahead. Talk. Um one of the other workers uh reached out to him and uh basically No. The guy that's over Melissa or my recruiter told um another worker that he was gonna try to keep the whole crew together whenever uh we move. So. so hopefully, the only thing that is going to probably change is the fact that they will be getting a Airbnb. Airbnb instead of a hotel room. Which I'm still going to try to bring, uh, you know, our babies and Christe. Um, yeah. If not, man it up. <laughs> the only thing we can do. Yeah, because I wouldn't want to rent. We're trying to save as much yeah. as we can at the moment. So we wouldn't want to do a, a hotel. If I was making like good, good money, like 2000 a week, then maybe. But no, that's the right now. Right now he makes a roughly a thousand more. 13, 1300. Uh, is it 13? Yeah, 13. before taxes. Before taxes, but after taxes is a thousand, a thousand one hundred and eighty-two. Oh dang! Tell them the whole story. <laughs> but hey. we still have bills, guys. <laughs> Cell phone is a hundred and twenty-five because we pay for three. So y'all know I pay for my nieces, my goddaughter. Um, storage. It recently went up. We it went from one forty four to one sixty two. One forty one forty two to one sixty two. There you go. 
We still have that. And then our car payment that is due every two weeks of 288. And then insurance recently went out of insurance, so we're looking for a new insurance. Um, so yeah, we're looking for something cheap. Um, yeah. And then, well, my dad's the last person that I own now. Because I gave him 300 this past week, and now I just need to give him 270 but we're, we're doing good, guys. We're grateful we have something over our heads. Giving the van a break, because poor van. <laughs> she needs a lot of maintenance now. She chilling. Chilling with mommy, right? She never gives kisses. Yeah, she's she's really hard on giving kisses. <laughs> She's the one that was getting, um... No, I take them. I would take them. She was the one that was getting hit by her... Peoples. Her other people. People we took her from. <laughs> y'all, we never told y'all. We, we, uh, when we were over there, um, a couple days before we went to Mo Ranch, um, the little boy that... Used to belong. The, yeah, the people that she used to belong to, they they saw her and she noticed them <laughs> and she cried and came. She's like, she was crying and she was panicking. She was, <laughs> <laughs> and I took her back inside and then once the kid left, I took her back outside so she can use the, you know, go restroom. And then there was another guy there too. And she did the same thing and she started crying more and the guy looked at me like and looked at her he looked at Layla I said come here Layla and then <laughs> because we kept the same name that she had because her name was Layla when she they had her and she had already been like so old yeah like and I didn't want to change it but my sister said after that they got another dog and it looks so identical do, yeah, and they do the same thing to her, her or him. I don't know what they do. What kind of dog, boy or girl? But I had to do what I had to do. I had to take her away from being abused. Ma, it happened to mommy. It happened to daddy. And not only that, guys, she was eating a diaper and she was filthy. She was covered in fleas. Like, I was scared to take her home with me because to my of other how girls. Nasty she was. Because she was really bad. And I was just like, no, I'll take like her that. a shower. No, Dad. I now like she's flea free, tick free. She had big old ticks, guys. She was eating a diaper. Now she eats good kibbles. No, but Not she still tries thing. to be a street dog. Oh, sometimes, yeah. She'll, She's so used to it. We'll be out there doing whatever, and she'll pick up trash, and we're just like, hey, hey, what are you doing? Or in here, she'll uh, get in the trash can in the restroom. We're like, hey, no, no, no. Yeah, and Thomas has <laughs> a habit of leaving the door open in the restroom. And I because get it's, it's annoying. <laughs> it's annoying that you leave it open. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, and we got girls, doggies that want to get in there. I bug her. She's okay. I bug her. She's trying to go with you. Oh, you like daddy? Oh, she gave me daddy kisses. She barely gives them to me, guys, or <laughs> any either of us. Where are you going? Oh, yeah, she wants to go. With you. Oh, big girl! Oh, big girl! Oh, it's such a big girl! Come on! <laughs> she give me already. Oh, I'm all scratched up now. They shed horrible. Oh, they shed a lot. I'll, like, don't let her claws on here because I don't want her to scratch it. Oh, she don't like being no. held that way. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Careful. What are you doing? <laughs> you want to be a mommy? Oh, your baby, dear mommy. Then she, guys, when she sleeps, 
She sleeps literally right, right. in between us. She don't want us to be together. No, it's it's she, she feels safe. Yeah, she feels safe in between us. Shake to her, you shake, shake, shake. No, let me not try to give her nothing. <laughs> She keeps smelling the food. Yeah, you can't have it. You know you can't have it. You should come on, Dad. <laughs> All right, All she's right. trying to get away. Go down. And lift my hair down today, you guys. Just put a little mousse. My hair is naturally like this. So, uh, guys, we're just frizzy. gonna keep we're gonna keep talking until it shuts off. But I don't know how much time we have left. Um, Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and always share. And if you have not yet clicked on that notification bell, please go click. That way you can be notified when we make new content. As always, stay happy, stay hopeful, stay blessed. Love y'all. That's just in case if it cuts off, guys. <laughs> um, what else? What else? What else? What else? For I those of you that fry.